Well, Hispanic Heritage Month was officially recognized back in 1988. Hispanic communities have history, though, in Siouxland dating back much further. KCAU 9's Chase Foy recently sat down with a local professor trying to share Latino stories across the area. Stacy Alex, a professor at Morningside University, has been documenting the lives of Hispanic communities in Siouxland. Newcomer populations are really important for our economy and our culture, um, but we have over 100 years of Latino history here in the Midwest. And so it's really just about um, letting people know right, what that history looks like and that Latino um, populations here in the Midwest have been um, just absolutely essential to who we are as the Midwest. Latinx Stories of Siouxland started back in 2020 with her goal to document the lives of people and then help Siouxlanders know about the contributions the Latino community has made. Also about um, helping people contextualize that history, right? That um, it goes all the way back to um, building our railroads, right? Um, agricultural work, um, but also all of our major industries have depended on Latino contributions. Professor Alex introduced me to a pair of subjects for her project, brothers who grew up around Sioux City. My parents are of Mexican descent. My grandparents, both the Manriques and the Betas, arrived in the United States uh, in 1918 and initially went to Texas, then to Wichita, Kansas, and then to Sioux City. Beta's father was the first Mexican-American officer for the Sioux City Police Department. During his years of service, he was known as the Ambassador in Blue, but Tony said he was known for a lot more. He was the Rivercade uh, guy a few times. He was uh, in, in uh, several parades around town. He was voted Man of the Year uh, by the auxiliary, uh, by the state police and stuff. He, he just, he loved his, his work uh, downtown on 4th and Pierce. Yeah, I think it's important that all people um, have a chance to celebrate their legacies, right? And, and have an archive to show, to point at, and say, this is what my people have contributed and continue to contribute. Siouxlanders can find Professor Alex's Latinx Stories of Siouxland online if they are interested about learning more about the Hispanic community's history. Celebrating Hispanic Heritage, Chase Foy, KCAU 9 News.